And I'm gonna take a call from our sweet Jedi fan, Rob Piggott. Hey, what's going on here? You know, Rob, I... I always... Uh, pronounce your name wrong, and I, I referred to you as Rob Pidgeot, much like the Pokemon. <laughs> it's all good, man. I can hear, I was listening to the party in the in the headset here, I can hear Ryan and Cody discussing the, the deep mysteries of Eva, and and also tactics on fighting these uh, ank inic varlet. See what I mean? Square the names here. Come on. I can't, I can't do that. It's an uncommon thing. Susan, name her Susan. I'll fight okay. Susan. Yeah. Why not? Why not? How are you, Rob? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Another long day of classes. I'm just uh, winding down the day by enjoying the stream. Ooh, that's uh, that's always a nice way to unwind is to hit the stream up and see what is going on over at Mega64 on the Poorly Played podcast. Hell yeah. You know, I refer to the stream as a podcast often. Yeah, it, it sort of is at this point. It's been, it's developed some things. I used a potion on accident. That's a problem I have where I kind of just mash the buttons. And I don't, paying attention to the timing. So th the way the combos kind of work in this game, and I don't know if it's like this in other MMOs, but you're on a timer, so you kind of like combo it out. But um, man, I've really just not been paying attention well, uh, especially because I'm on the phone with you. <laughs> but that's all right. How are you? Uh, wait, I already asked you that. Let's take that again. Three, two, one. Brother. Uh, what is your question, Rob? How can I help you in a time of need? Well, first of all, Garrett, I wanted to say uh, thank you for the uh, the shout out on uh, last week's uh, after show. Oh, the shoots out. Yeah, that was, uh, that was really nice of you. I appreciate it. Oh, you're quite welcome. When we were discussing who should make compilation videos, yeah, yeah, you do make some pretty fine compilation vids, man. Well, thank you. I really appreciate that. I'm poisoning uh, my enemy, and then it's got a draining effect over time. It's a very effective thing. Oh shit! My cat girl is like a pretty badass archer, so <laughs> I just I want you to know. Of course, of course. Okay. Be warned. So you make them videos, you put those compilations together. Have you worked yeah. on anything recently? I know you've been very busy with school, but you're, you're always tinkering at some point. Well, I'm working on two things right now for my channel. I'm working on a new GCP fan fiction theater. Oh, I love uh, the gaming called podcast fan fiction theaters you do. Mm-hmm. It's going to be based off the... Uh, the latest uh, improv fanfic that you guys all did. Oh, I see now. I haven't heard this latest improv fanfic, but I hear that Ryan and C is wait. Is it is it the one with uh, Sonic and what is it? The one with these drops it goes like. Ah! Mm -mm, I'm so oh I'm so horny. Mm. Is that the one? That's the one. Oh okay, I got gotcha. you. Good times. And then uh, I'm working on a, a video for that contest you guys have uh you guys are doing for the uh for your youtube channel okay all right is that something secret some secret rocco discussion that i don't know about uh no i mean i'm just i'm working on entry and i'll uh i'm gonna be submitting it at some point oh i okay so, i thought when yeah. you said something for rocco's channel i thought you were talking about rocco asked you to do something for his youtube channel oh no 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 I no just, you're no. discussing the the very popular pre-roll contest that we're having mm -hmm. yeah. so if the if the people watching at home right now if our dear listeners and lovely viewers don't know mega 64 is doing a pre-roll contest where you can create a pre-roll and it'll play before other videos yeah potentially yeah, yeah. You... details uh who knows where on our, on watch the mega 64 podcast sunday nights at seven Hell yeah. Let's see what's in the coffer. Let's see. Could be something I need, could be something I don't. Oh, there's still a villain here. We should kill him. I Good did thing. have a quick question, though, too. Oh, yes, for sure. Uh, on the last podcast, you guys were getting into a bunch of uh, Star Wars talk, talking about the new episode and the casting and stuff like that. I don't you know guys. what happened to the... What happened to the treasure? 
Oh no. Oh, no one obtained. Tra- I don't. I have no idea. Who, who cares? We'll move on. <laughs> yeah, on the last podcast. Yeah. Yeah, I just want to know what, Garrett. What is personally your favorite uh, Star Wars film? Favorite Star Wars film is gonna be the cliche clerk's answer of the Empire Strikes Back. Nice. That's a. It's an excellent choice. It's got the down ending. You're left wanting more from your heroes. They're downtrodden, and and it, it leaves you with anticipation. For what could come. This void soul counter is like a big beast. Look at this thing. Oh wow. I gotta get on I gotta get on it. Damn it, I accidentally used the fucking potion again. Okay, well we're getting better. But uh what about you? Uh we had May the fourth, some bullshit holiday that I don't believe in because (laughs) it just makes the internet annoying as fuck. But regardless, it was May fourth, one day after May fifth, another holiday that I don't really think is real. (laughs) <laughs> yeah yeah but um two fake yeah. ass holidays back to back what are the odds what are the odds none of, but, none of my mexican friends and co-workers uh celebrate cinco de mayo as their independence yeah isn't it just like a white person holiday basically? i believe in it's it's an excuse for college kids to drink a lot of alcohol basically yeah What's in this coffer? Oh, the loot. Plundered Harger Burden. Oh, I do not need that. Pass on that. There's a system where you can choose if you want to take the armor or if you want to leave it for someone else. Oh, okay. In That's your group. Cool. Someone, but, you know, I, I can't use it, so what's the point? Or you could choose greed and then you could sell it. So we have to, <laughs> we have to take out these little mid-bosses that are supplying energy to the big black ball in the sky, I assume. So let's do that. I'm going to cast Sprint. I'm going to go for it. Cool. I'm going the wrong way though. Jesus. This game looks really fun. I just Hey, it's I, it's fun and it is really fucking pretty. I mean, aside from yeah. just how stunningly gorgeous Lillen my cat is. Uh for those that don't know, the cat Lillen, my character here, is a uh, she's a virtual representation of a flesh world avatar I own named Lillen the cat. Well, Lillen Hunter, but this one's got more of a proper surname. And, and I definitely refer to her as a flesh world avatar because I think that the real star of the show here is my level 19 archer, Lilin the Cat, and that my feline at home just kind of represents her as a, as a real world avatar type companion to me. Yeah, because that... rem- yeah, remember, Garrett, the, the world of Final Fantasy XIV is the same as the real world, so... It is. It's a realm that's been reborn, and, and you know, I've chosen to reborn my pet cat uh, as a, a, a very attractive cat girl. So, it's it's much different than a cat in many respects. I, that, I don't need to name. You can... You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you for calling in. We sure do love you, Rob. No problem, Garrett. You have a good night. These guys are casting dark magic. I, I gotta get to them. Get to it. I'm on it. I'm one-handing, and I'm two-handing the mouse. Look at that. Talent. <laughs> Boom. Boom. <laughs> 